hello everyone this is Kerry Anderson hope you are doing well in today's video I'll be talking about the reasons why your manifestation is not working so if you like the video related to manifest power I would like to request you all please do like share subscribe so that I will come up with more and more videos so here we begin let's go why is not your manifestation working it's the age-old question when spiritual new buys discover the law of attraction you will feel aligned you set your intention you and your girl in the universe totally speak each other's language you are vibing and then nothing no manifestation nothing not even a little sign yeah universe i thought we had a deal i feel the feelings and you deliver the good stuff right so why is not the genie coming out of the lamp yet and you would be right in expecting that in all honesty sometimes manifestation can happen in the blink of an eye i would have asked the universe for things before matched my energy in low and behold they arrived we hear these stories about thousands of pounds landing in bank accounts overnight or soulmates popping up a coffee shop the same week but what about the manifestation that take a little longer when do we hear about those i have attempted to attract things into my life and have been met with silence on a number of occasions and it's junk at the time however over the years of successful and failed wishes to the universe i begin to recognize shifts in energy and changes in how i was approaching the process the first thing people assume when their manifestation is not granted is that they did something wrong they maybe they had too many negative thoughts they are not manifesting hard enough the universe has not heard them maybe they are not worthy of what they have asked for honestly unless you are trying to manifest something to harm yourself or the others then those reasons are not why your manifestation is not working so here is what i have discovered over the years so you don't feel truly aligned the key to manifesting at the very core is to match our energy to the things we want if we want to create a life filled with happiness and welcome abundance the law states we must raise our own energetic frequency to tune in with other high vibrations to do this we must imagine how we will feel when our manifestation are ours the love we will feel or the freedom the happiness or even the relief this is what people mean when they tell you to feel the feelings ah, that old law of attraction just not but what happens if you are truly aligned with what you are trying to manifest for example if you are trying to manifest a million pounds but can't even imagine what 10,000 pounds might feel like how can you match your energy if the alignment is not there if you want to manifest money start small and build your way up like i did start with 10 pounds and move up to 50 pounds move to 100 pounds and then to 300 pounds in 2018 i asked the universe to help me manifest 1300 pounds a month after i was made redundant and now i'm manifesting 7k pounds month in the business that i launched so that did not happen overnight because i had to build my alignment up and always make sure you are manifesting for you and not for what do you think others want for you this rings especially true for manifesting about our bodies i have known clients to try and manifest stones lost when in fact what they actually wanted to manifest was self-love and appreciation for the body they had it was societal pressure that was making them feel otherwise so you are holding on to tie okay so so you are fully aligned and you can really imagine how you will feel when your manifestation comes to fruition in fact it's all you ever think about where is the universe with your delivery should not it be here by now you are manifesting so hard so this is what i what is called desperate energy holding on this tide is signaling to the universe that there is a lack of crust imagine ordering food is a restaurant and waiting impatiently outside the kitchen because you did not believe the chef was cooking to cook your food or waiting outside your door because you did not believe my homes was going to deliver your amazon parcel wait actually but in all seriousness holding on so tight to your manifestation and obsessing about it will only stop the flow of energy some experts tell you to set the intention 
and release so release to the universe and don't think about it again personally i like to say hold on loosely release a manifestation of course have trust and faith that it will appear when the time is right but also look at how you can meet the universe halfway maybe visualize your manifestation coming true once a week when you are relaxed lying in bed with your eyes closed maybe script once a month hang pictures on your vision board what i'm trying to say is don't have the manifestation take over your every waking thought nor should you forget about it and never think it again it's a fine balance and one that takes a little time to perfect but you can absolutely shift your mindset with a little practice now you are not being specific enough when we give a vague order to the universe how can we be surprised when she does not deliver so you want to be a rich but what is your definition of rich finding 10 dollars or a 10 pounds on the street could feel rich winning the euro millions could feel rich so you have to get a clear picture and get specific on the details not only does it make it easier for your energies to align but it also means signs and signals leading you to your manifestation are much more obvious because of the clarity you have for the coaching clients that come to me to manifest love we start with getting super clear on the qualities they want in a partner by writing a cosmic shopping list not necessarily a list of physical characteristic but looking more to personal and spiritual qualities such as loyalty sense of humor being kind wants to travel wants to start a family etc the reason we don't focus on physical aspects is because if we become too focused on looking for someone with dark hair to enter our life and then your soulmate has in fact a head with no hair there is potential you will miss him completely so a cosmic shopping list could also be used when manifesting a house listing the area you want to live in how many bedroom the style of the house etc let the universe know what is in your head and set the intentions on paper be specific now right manifestation wrong time it is a glitch to say but sometimes our manifestation is not working because it's simply not the right time in your life to receive it divine timing plays a huge part in the life journey and there are times when you look back over the years and think thank god i did not get the job or thank god i moved when i did because the universe has a timing planned along we just could not see it until hindsight i live fully by the notion of divine timing now and have faith that the right thing will come at the right time when my energy is at the place it needs to be so there were years especially as i entered my 30s when i wondered if love would ever arrive this was before i really moved into the spiritual path i thought my journey should have been like the majority of friends who had settled down and had children but at as i started to embrace a new way of thinking it still my heart to know the universe had a different plan a different or a better plan to suit my life to allow me to experience all the amazing things i have ahead of my 36th birthday in two months new love will come when the time is right once you understand divine timing is always a playing a part it makes life a whole lot easier to embrace trust me now something better is coming one of the most frequent dms i will receive on social media is about people trying to manifest their dream house and it's seemingly falling through they go view it they fall in love it's everything they have been manifesting and they get goosebumps now but you know what else comes after that initial message to me a follow up telling me that was not their dream house they have actually found something even better and the offer has been accepted something better was always in the background waiting to shine when a thing person of opportunity similar to our manifestation appears we can often be tricked into thinking yes this is it i it worked then when it does not work out how we imagine we feel an angry and resentful at the universe but this is simply a transition period she warming you up making you realize what you don't want rather than what you do you are going through a transformation period that's leading you to abundance something better is coming life might not always go the way you thought it's often a series of twists and turns but that's what make it all the more sweet when our energies finally align with our manifestation and it comes into fruition now when your our glasses are steamed up 
for all the disappointment of our manifestation not arriving it's hard to be able to see that it was actually working out all along something better is coming i promise wipe your glasses and get ready to see the signs if you feel any of these in your heart please know you're not alone in wondering why your manifestation is not working i hope at least this post has put your mind at rest if you ever want to chat all pink manifestation feel free to chat to me on uh, Kerry and Anderson 20081989 at gmail.com and more importantly don't forget to join me over on Instagram so that's all about the manifest power in this video I definitely count the next video with my another content till then God bless you take care bye bye